Megan. And then we hey. um, I've been working on this client for probably a year and a half or so. And um, we've made lots of progress, but it's just not very fast. And I, I want to give her more progress. Um, she has severe fatigue. She'll go to bed at 7 p.m. She'll take a nap. Um, she was diagnosed a couple of years ago with Epstein-Barr. I don't know if she still has it. Um, okay. There was talk of maybe she had mono. Um, so I've been doing, I've been trying to focus on the lymphatic system and working on the lungs and combing the health rays and um, cleaning the arms and legs a ton and doing lower chakras a ton. And it's kind of like, um, it's just not a big change. It's just like really slow. Mm. And um, and then I thought, I don't know if there's an endocrine issue. I know that can be involved in fatigue and I'm just less uh, knowledgeable about endocrine than. Yeah, sure, sure. Well, endocrine system super complicated. Um, it, like, is there any other kind of details or anything? We just know that she's um, fatigued. Uh, it was really low blood pressure before, but now it's it's pretty close to normal on the low side of normal. And then thyroid was an issue. Low thyroid. And is the thyroid getting better or no? I don't know. I haven't asked if she's had that tested. And I, I, don't I would know. treat the thyroid. Um, you could have her use a clove. To, to balance it, like any time the thyroid's off, clove be it too high, too low can help balance balance things out. Okay. Um, and that could affect the energy level. But I, I mean, I think all of these are symptoms, but is there like any bigger thing that's kind of going on or? Not that we know of. And um, so, and I'm doing pranic healing. It's twice a week. And she does have some oils because she's taken a couple classes. I don't know her whole collection, but I know she has the Metatron kit. And I know um, she took one of the lymphatic modules, which she said just completely knocked her out. Like she was practically in bed the whole next day. It must have stirred up a lot of old stuff. So yeah. that's kind of all the data I have. And you want to treat her with oils or you want to treat her with pH? Um, pH for now. I think it's probably a little hard for her to do a lot of stuff at home. Um, she always says she wants to, but, you know, I don't want to try to pressure her. So I think she probably just wants to get treated right now. Maybe when she has a little more energy, she might want to do more oils at home. Okay, this is this is w what I'd like you to like kind of focus on is you're going to do this thing where you're going to have her visualize when you're working on her, right? Okay. And so have her visualize herself in a ball of light. Okay. While she's doing that, you sweep the the aura. Like, you know, you just do general sweeping, mm -hmm. like go through, clean up front, back, and even on the sides. Like, you know, like look at it from the side and like you're sweeping the front of her body, but like, you know, do five lines on, on each side. Like you're, okay. you're really doing that. And then even clean the, like after you have swept it down, she's still visualizing the ball, clean the basic, the spleen, the Ming Men and a crown in that order. Basic, spleen, Ming Men, crown. Yeah. Okay. And so that's going to flush more out of her aura, right? That like that, like releases things out of the, the aura. So then after you've done that, then tell her just to let go, right? And then when she lets go again, kind of sweep, but then you're going to have to evaluate where is it coming out? It's most likely going to come out of the, the spine, the arms and the legs, or the lower chakras, potentially the brain, but my guess would be one of the first three. 
and then clean that up a little bit and then have her visualize in the white ball again and then just keep repeating the process over and over again okay yeah thank you yeah do that there's a next step after that but that will be several sessions worth of work okay so just doing that over like and over again six sessions or something like that oh probably like three maybe okay yeah okay yeah. thank you yeah and then let me know how she's doing. Like, shoot, just shoot a quick email or something. Let me know how she's doing. And we can make an adjustment, you know, soon. 